Alright, so what is going on guys? Welcome to another Garden Warfare 2 video. Today is episode number 12 of my fan favourite series. This is the series where I get and play as a character from Garden Warfare 1, which was one of my personal favourites and the community's favourites, and see how much they have changed in Garden Warfare 2. Now today we're going to be playing as the Jade Cactus. I just want to say she looks absolutely amazing in this game. They've put so much more effects and shine onto these characters. Just look at how she looks. She looks absolutely amazing. And there's going to be some people that's going to be commenting in the sec uh, question in the comment section down below saying the cactus is a male. The cactus character is actually a female. So if I do mistakenly say he, it is a she. Um, but look at this character. I just love when you when you like the lights like glows off her because she's made out of jade. It's absolutely amazing. Just look at her. She is fantastic. We are rocking a couple of upgrades. We got a speed upgrade, a health regeneration upgrade, and a uh, uh, well, two health, uh, two health upgrades, and also a speed upgrade. And we will get another upgrade once we do get her to level nine. So we are going to head over into some multiplayer. I do have uh, a couple of quests. We do get some new type of quests as well. Uh, one of them was to do with uh, the Chomper S rank. Uh, but look at this, contributing to capturing a garden or graveyard 50 times in turf takeover. That is a new one. That is a new one. We're going to taunt three players. Uh, should we actually go and do turf takeover? I don't know. What should we do? Turf takeover or vanquish confirmed? Uh, I'm going to do vanquish confirmed just because I do have a have this one selected as well. So that is two quests in one. And a vanquish 25 human opponents in multiplayer so there you go if you did not know you can do a lot of quests in private matches so this one is then you have to get it in a multiplayer and it has to be an actual human player which is very uh, very nice and uh, we can't pick anything else up so let us go in to some vanquish confirms i'm going to cut the video here guys and i will catch you in a second all right so here we are guys unfortunately we are having to play a turf takeover because a lot of people are at school right now i actually wasn't able to find myself a game of vanquish confirmed so we have gone on to some turf takeover uh i did pick up the other quest that we do have so i want to try and complete three games of turf takeover which we're not going to do in today's game and also contribute to capturing a garden or graveyard 50 times so whether that's you need to actually have captured a slight little bit of the garden 50 times, which is a lot of turf takeover games. That probably, I don't know what, 10, 15 games where you're actually physically capturing rather than defending. That is a difficult one, to be honest. Like, I have a feeling that's how it works, but uh, I have absolutely no idea. All right, come on. Oh, no, he's got his missile madness. Come on. Let's try and do a lot of damage. There we go. Mech Vanquish, thank you very much. I did want to try and take out Captain Flameface, which he's right there, and we do manage to take him out. Kill two birds with one stone, and then we get a third vanquish there as well. So I actually love the Jade Cactus. I love the Jade Cactus if you miss the shot, but it still lands around their feet. You still have the potential chance of uh, of dealing some damage to the character. She's got a great rate of fire, and she actually deals a decent amount of damage as well. You cannot forget about the damage. Oh no, get out of your mech. No! She got a mech in. Oh, he got his mech in. Looks like we're going to have to punish him. Alright, he must be getting a lot. Yay! He was down. I thought we may have got something a little bit different than assist, uh, but that's fine. That's fine. Let's just carry on going to the side. I don't want to push too far forward just because in case the zombies then see me uh, spawning on me. Where are you going? Where are you going? Come back here. Ah, darn it. Assist again. Oh, that's a good shot on the foot soldier. Oh, I can just peep through the window. Look at that. I feel there's a cactus near me. Like, right near me. Alright, I should really get on that objective and contribute to capturing. Nope. Didn't didn't contribute to capturing. That was uh, that was my mistake. I should have tried to contribute a little bit. See, nothing, nothing done. Nothing done on the quest. Oopsie. My mistake. Alright, there's another vanquish. What are we on? Level 9. So what do we get? We get a reload upgrade. Very nice. When we do die... Or do you get vanquished? I'm going to pop that on. If I do forget, which I do probably the majority of the time, um, remind me in the comment section. Be like, you didn't, you forgot to do this and you forgot to do that. And I've been forgetting to taunt as well. That's one thing which I have been doing. So let us do it after we do take this Ulster out. Wherever he is. Where is he? Where is this guy? There he is. He's got so far away, you must have sprint tackled. 
There we go. Let's uh, let's let's get a little taunt in there. Can we do it with the imp as well? Oh, what a vanquish! Oh yeah, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Well, we've got three or five now. We're making our way on the quests. Very nice. There's actually some new quests in the game, like I did mention earlier. There's another one, which is get ten vanquish streak, which is actually a really really cool one. I like that one. It's not too difficult, and it's an epic one. So you actually get 25,000 coins for getting a 10 Vanquish Streak, which I'm almost on right now. So if you are good at getting Vanquish Streaks, you can get 25,000 coins very, very easily for just completing that quest. Oh, I'm up here. I thought I was going to be down there for a second. I have no idea why, but I just, I just had a feeling that I was going to be at the bottom and I'd have to w walk up the top. Alright, should we call her a little bit of our drone in? Should we call her... Actually, no. If I was going to say call her drone in, we're probably going to get a... We're probably going to get a... Get vanquished. There we go. We'll show off the 5,000 coins. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I want to head over to this objective. I want to at least contribute to... Whoa, 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 whoa. Come down. Alright, come here, mech. I, find, I always find it funny when a mech can actually jump. I don't know why, I just find it funny because a mech's huge and yet they can still jump. I don't know why I find it funny, but I just do. And I love the taunts that they can do as well. Alright, there's a Captain Deadbeard over there, so let's see if we can if we can take him out. There we go, there's another one. Very nice. Now the uh, the Zen Cactus uh, not the Zen Cactus, the J Cactus is a sniper. So you do want to stay back, but with her rate of fire and everything like that, she uh she can she can I was just gonna say she can take a bit of a punch at close range, but uh I don't know about the super brains, because the super range does have two hundred health and also deals damage a lot a lot quicker than um than I will. So probably not they're not against the super brains, but uh, she can take on a few a few characters. Um at close range because she has got 150 health which is always very nice to have the extra health and of course she does move slower and I have already forgot to put the reload upgrade on. I knew I would forget it. I knew I would forget it. Alright this barrel blast must be almost done. Oh he gets turned into a goat. Go Rose. I don't know how I got an assist for that to be honest. But go on Rose. Turn the barrel or the pirate into a goat. Oh, there's a mech behind me, and not anymore. One hit, and he went down. Shatter shot. Alright, any sunflowers around? Any sunflowers want to give us a bit of a healing hand? A little bit of heals? Anyone? We'll probably hop down here. Spawn up a heal weed or something like that. And we should be good to go. You can actually, uh, another quest is vanquishing um, 25 terracotta weeds. Which is a cool one as well. That one's not too bad to do in the Flag of Power. Because of course, fly, uh, Terracotta Weeds do spawn in the Flag of Power. But they're just not as common. What's that? Is that, is that a Power Ranger? I think that's a Power Ranger. Looks like a Power Ranger. Whoa, go away. Have some of these Petu demands. Alright, where can I heal? Where can I spawn a... A, a, a plant? Surely there should be a plant spawn over here. In this location, like right there, there should be one. Nope. Nope. They let us down. There we are. Let's get a couple of shots on there. Oh, that was a nice hit. Come on. Have some of this, Camel Ranger. One more hit. There we go. Woo! Oh yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Let's get the long range sniper shots in here. <laughs> You're taunting as well, but you get taken out. Thank you very much. I don't know why I put these potato mines here. Oh, there's one right there. I was looking all over the place for a heal spot. And there's one right here. What should we spawn up? Let's spawn up a porcelain vase weed. Let's do it. Maybe those assist towards capturing the garden. I'm curious, do they assist? So if I put like two or three of them down, is that going to count towards two or three? Towards the quest? I uh, I guess we, we we can find out. Yeah. 
Alright, let's take out this all star. Let's try and take out the all star. Using his infant. Alright, let's uh, let's go on to the objective. Whoa, keep away from the gravity grenade though. Alright, let's get on here if we can. Let's try and get at least something on this objective. Alright, there we go. If we get anything else, let's have a look how much we contributed to the quest then. Let's see if we contributed at all to the quest. Let's have a look. Uh, 3 of 50, so I'm guessing it's just every every few seconds. It will uh, it will count or contribute towards it. No idea. Come on, Ulster, come back. There you are. There we go, level 10. Oh, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to rank up my character anymore now. And I keep forgetting to put the reload upgrade on. Let's pop that on now. Oh, nope, never mind. As soon as I remember, I get revived. Which is fine. I don't mind being revived. But uh, I do want to put that reload upgrade on instead of one of these health regeneration upgrades on. Because we have got the speed upgrade on, so we are going to be moving quicker. Which is cool. Especially for the J Cactus, because the J Cactus does move slower. But overall, she's a really good character. One of my favorite ones in the game. Or one of my favorite cactus. Come on. Come back here, little impy. Where are you? Disappear. That's where you are. There you are. An assist? We hit him twice. We did like 40 damage to him and we get an assist? What is this? What is this blasphemy? Alright, there we go. Nice little vanquish to start it off. Let's make that two. Nope, never mind, we get an assist. Oh, we could get this mech though. There we go. Oh, he's run away. He's like, no, I don't want to get fired at. Alright, let's do the long range jump. Jump vanquish. Oh no, what's this imp? There you are. No! How much health was you on? 36, 67%. I was gonna say, I don't know why I was gonna say 30, because I only took 25 health off him, but... No, I kept forgetting again! I forgot again! Alright, we're gonna do it. We are gonna do it. See, it even prompts us to say we have a new upgrade, but we keep forgetting to put it on. Alright. There we go. We got the reload upgrade on eventually. I'm sure some people was in the comment section like, put the upgrade on! Because I did remind you. There's an enemy behind us somewhere. What are you doing over here? Eh? I'm gonna punish you for uh, coming to our spawn. There we go. See? You come into our spawn, you get punished. Thank you. I do appreciate the heals. Now let's go take some zombies down. Oh, oh no, we get a little crash. Just as I was attacking the Z7 mech as well. But, poof, disappeared. Oh no, there he is. Come on, Rose, time snare him. Never mind, he's gone. He is gone. Alright, I was hoping that he may have walked into that, but he didn't. So, I need to get on this objective. I need to get some capture points if I can. Oh no. What are you doing over there, Super Range? You should not be over there. Stop hiding in the corner. We got taken out by the uh, by the tennis star anyway. But um, I need to get on that objective. I'm going to spawn up some more weeds. Some terracotta weeds will do. Because they, they're probably going to get over to the objective. I think. What do we got? Let's go for these weed wood shields. They've got extra health. These will help towards the. Uh, these will help towards the contribution, hopefully, and uh, we can make our way along. There we go. Here's another one. Let's spawn another one of these up. There we go. Let's keep spawning them as many of these up as we can, because we don't want to lose the game here. That is one thing we do not want to do, is to lose the game right here. We want to at least get onto the mini game and uh, show them that the plants rule. And the world is not going to get destroyed.
Alright, let us get on here. For as long as we can get on. No, it was not very long at all. <laughs> we was on there for literally one second. And then we died. I think we did contribute to it, to it though. We got four. I'm wondering if it's just maybe every second you're on there for. That's, that's how long it contributes. I don't know if the terracotta's count at all. I don't know. I don't know. We've got nine seconds though. I'm not going to be able to get there in time. Hopefully, fingers crossed, someone else can get there from the enemy team. Uh, not from the enemy team, from the rest of our team. No, we don't make it there, unfortunately. We do complete some of the quests though. Look at that. The zombies were really set up there. Oh, there's Colonel Connor Fire Chomper there. Just a little bit too late, unfortunately. We didn't manage to, uh, to capture that objective. We did get four bases though. So we can't complain with that. 21,000 coins, not too bad at all. But Jay Cactus is still a really, a really good character. Ah, oh, I thought that was us there. I thought we got the highest vanquish streak. We actually, I'm sure we got 11. I'm sure we got an 11 streak as well. I'm sure we got 11. Let's have a look. What did we get? Yeah, we got an 11 streak as well as the Jay Cactus. 10 assists, 20 was the highest. We went 24 and 6, so we did go uh, reasonably good uh, with the Jay Cactus. So overall, not too bad at all. If you did enjoy today's video, make sure you do give it a like down below. It lets me know that you do enjoy the videos and that you do want to see some more. So thank you very much for watching. My name is Zero Exfusions and hopefully I'll catch you guys next time.